Hi buddy, uh, welcome to a new uh, mini-series, and uh, mainly because I, um, at the time you're watching this, going to be on my way to Turkey. Uh, spelt differently now, of course, but I saw this um, on a couple of videos from other people I watch, plus uh, read some of the reviews, and this game, it looks really fun, and it's really simple, um, but beautiful graphic, well, it's that style of graphics, I like that cartoony graphics, and uh, hopefully the audio is all set, but let's start a new game, shall we? So, here's the old cutscene, where we are in our little boat, we're a fisherman by the way, and we're going to the angler one to job over, obviously over there, and again, the artwork is, is really nice, I do like this style of artwork. And, uh, Oh dear, that wasn't good, was it? So, uh, the lighthouse really didn't do its job. <laughs> but um, we end up at this small coastal town, which definitely has a chthonic feel to it. Uh, and you'll see more as you go through the game why things. Morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit up right line. Cold wet dot where you collapsed the night before. A short man, I would have said a stout man actually, but a short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat. The man notices you. Ah, welcome to Greater Marrow, I must say. Quite dramatic first impression as he always reduced yourselves to the jagged rocks along the bay. Haha, <laughs> very funny. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. No, I didn't. We it's obviously off. Oh well, I'm glad that our new fisherman see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Hmm. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get by so I saw him down before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time, it can really creep up on you. Okay. So, this is our boat that we've been gifted by the mayor. And I say gifted, this is the town of Greater Marrow and this is the tutorial. So, forward, backwards, AD, everything like that. Yeah, okay. You can rotate the camera and adjust the height. Move to a fishing spot like this. Press F to fish. And then mini game kind of thing where you just hit F on the things and I've got a mackerel now. I've only got this fishing rod, I've got an engine, I've got, got a certain amount of space. So, well, for some reason I actually tried to click them. So blue mackerel obviously very hard to fish. Uh, and there's a lot of people dis debate at the moment about the mini games that we have for X to leave. The 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 issues we have with inventory management in games. Uh, okay, we're going to start fishing. Uh, and there's a card, and this game's ha actually turned it into a mini game, quite literally. <coughs> you know, it's it's Tetris with fish almost. <coughs> now, time only advances when you're moving or fishing, so it quite literally does not move. The thing is I can't fish this, the reason being is I don't have the right fishing rod. Uh, we don't want to sail into the rocks, that's always a bad idea. And you can see our boat's pretty slow, so let's have our lights on as well. Not that we need them at the moment, can't fish that. Don't know whether I can fish any of these. Yes I can, okay. Uh, 
What did I get? More blue mackerel. Okay. And it's 4.30, so we should probably head home. But I'm not going to. Because there's fish to be had here. Now we'll head home. But it's, it's getting dark. <coughs> and you can see there's a, a little eye appeared on the top of the screen. And that is my, for want of a better word, sanity meter. Now I can toggle my lights on and off. Or I can even I'm sure they said that most people were out and I'm the only person out here but uh, F to dock oh you have to hold it okay first playthrough I've not played this before so the mayor is looking, waiting nearby Returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your boat was too badly damaged to repair. However, I'm more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds, so we'll consider it a loan, but I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go to paying it off, and a small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So, to recap, you need to sell fish to the local market, paying off either a tier, blah, blah, understand. Okay, and where do we sell the fish? Well, it's fairly obvious. It's a fishmonger, and this gentleman here is a fishmonger. The uh, smell of fish fills the air, flies buzz haphazardly, downcast man behind the counter. Oh. You know, the new fisherman surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He it takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more too. Other towns on the other island may pay different, but while you've still got debt outstanding here, I suggest you work on paying it off first. Mm. So let's see what you've got. Sell all my fish. Oh. Yeah. So, <coughs> we've got $128, and we lost some things, so that was good. And now... Excellent work, I've no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you can make something of it. Why don't you take it? This is a research point. Um, Pole part. Shipwright mentioned they might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. So, shipwright. So this lady is the shipwright. Um, she looks up briefly, turns back. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favours around here. Payment up front is up front and everything takes time to install. If you take any damage, I can pass it up mostly. She scrubs towards the hull. She's currently attempting to repair a number of wood boards. All well above the waterline, splinting and scratch. Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. So, we've got a fishing rod, which I assume I cannot move. Uh, and we got $128, we could buy this, which allows us to fish the shallow waters. We can buy a rusty old outboard motor. Um, we already have a peculiar engine, which gives us 14 knots, that gives you plus 10 knots. Um, we've got no nets, and we can't afford any lights yet. So, probably, that leaves us with $53, uh, we'll return to town, we can do research where we can do a hydraulic rod, uh, gives us 50% speed, uh, fishing speed. So we might as well take that as well. And it's now available in stores, of course it is. We don't just get it. So let's just quickly go over. Oh yeah, there we go. 
Ah, right. So I could I can't fit it in because I haven't got enough slots. So this is the Tetris mini game that you've got. So that was actually a waste of a research point. However, can I have a? Can I not alter that? Okay, no. Okay, the encyclopedia tells us about the fish. There are a lot of fish. So we've got blue mackerel and cod, and there's this aberrations. So this is why there's a lot of fish. And look back. Pursuits is old jobs. Messages, messages, map shows us the map. And we should probably sleep until the morning. And then we can undock and go fishing. Now at the moment we are just hammering. That's just a boy. It just tells you about the rocks. This um, not really a great deal of point to going over there. Uh, so this is shallow water and that is a gulf flounder. So we'll have some of them. Stock is low. So I wonder whether we're better off managing the stock a little better or not. Doesn't really matter because we've just depleted the stock on that. So let's head over this way. There's another town over there, which I think is Small Marrow off the top of my head. Uh, okay, what we got? More blue mackerel. Okay. Trophy fish. Worth more. Get one more, I think. And that is about it. One o'clock and we're already there. Let's head over and have a look at this old town over here. But it is, it's a very pretty game. Um, and I quite like the... What was the... What was that? Oh, new encyclopedia entries, okay. Uh, so we've got storage and a trader. Brought a lip shop, back with antiques, shelves full of jewellery. Bold man peers you over silver spectacles. Oh no, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes on what they used to be. I specialise in antiques and jewellery. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Uh, no. I don't. But um, that's probably our cue to go home. And see... Wow, this is slow. Things, but it's half three anyway. We definitely don't want to be out after night if we can avoid it. Um, and there isn't a ta I think there's a couple of things. Way for me, there's a couple of ways to kind of play this. There's the bum rushing all the missions, which you know to me is is not that exciting. Or Right, so we've got 27.32 remaining. So what do you want? You tell me about the order. He wants one gold flounder and one flounder and one grey eel. Yes, okay, that's fine. Have I got? Yes, I do. I have a gold flounder. I'll see. So this is the other thing that's nice. You can actually just stock things up like that and leave it in place. Uh, done, and right, come back with you. That takes us to 131. Debt adjusted is now is down uh, some more, and 
I don't think we can actually afford we could afford these crap lights um, better than a candle just so that's got 10 meters that's got 20 <coughs> I am going to leave that and we'll have a snooze for the night because it's only day two on day three now you see so yeah there's no rush oh lighthouse keeper conscious woman she's uh, looks at you with concern and visible why are you here you've come to fish okay so you can see why there's a certain um chthonic vibe going on so we need one eel and one flounder for that okay soups is the way of saying thing um thing now we've done the flounder is a way of saying quests now there's something interesting over there so we'll head to that but we're going to stop here first because this hang on is your eel oh I'm I am really fouling this up I don't know why I was fouling that up so badly, but we'll have another one while we're at it. Oh, rats. Ah! This is harder than it looks, believe it or not. I'm going to leave the eel for a second. Let's go and have a look at what that is over there. That over there is rub is debris which we cannot get yet we need to get the dredging bit but uh that was added to our cabin uh oops so that's that one messages morning of the second day of honeymoon first day proper blah 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 yeah there's a storyline here basically which we can read later Let's go and have a look. It's three o'clock, so we do need to be heading back very shortly. I don't know why I... There we go. Cod. Wow. That took some time up okay yeah that's how to make yourself go even more well see why you need the lights Uh, oh, the lights on. Panic is what they call it. It's basically insanity in any other game. Yes, I did. Bonk. Couple of squid and a whole black group. Now these guys only do at night, so and I know squid only do at night, so let's But we can afford a light now, so let's go to the shipwright. And we're sorted. Let's sleep. So it's six in the morning. Um, the mayor wants to chat. 
Optimus person, will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow, package to the dock worker there? Yes, of course I would. Small damp package dripping. I mean, please do be quick. I don't want it to spoil. Yeah, I know where it's going. So, let's take the opportunity. You can see we've now got our light on, which is all nice. To go straight over to here. Get that package dropped off. And, uh, well, I'll be back in a moment. I want to check how long I've been recording because this is enjoyable and I'm, you know, it's kind of a non-stop thing. So I'll be back in a second. Yeah, fine. I've been going about 20 minutes, so... Let's go. There we go. Oh, a delivery. Let's see. Tears a small hole and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels like he's shielding it from your view. Uh, okay, he hands you some money. Uh, okay, and he gives us a book. Keep it, I will read it. Stop by for a chap. I know how lonely it can be. Okay. So, selected as active book. Past time to read. And it's sustainable fishing. So, obviously, we don't know what it's about other than probably fishing, which is somewhat sustainable. Uh, what's here? Uh, Oops, oh wow, big fella, okay. We'll leave the stingray because I want some space for some other stuff. This is... Dredge, you can't do anything, that's a dredge site. Over there is a man. I don't think we can do much with it at this stage. But we'll just head over and see if we can't. One more. Keep my eye on the time there. One more. Because it's getting late, but we've got a light now, so at least we're a little bit less schizoid about things. And here... Door is locked. Go inside. Oh, taking a moment. Oh, pick up some ice. Oh, yeah, because I um, I bought the additional thing, which is the this island. So I think an arterial engine. That was weird. Signs of ruin. Let's just put that in storage uh, and undock. Whoa. Oh dear. And now I've got to get used to the new speed. But we've got a full hold. I think that arterial engine will be coming back out though. I don't know. I need to have a good look at that. I was just very conscious of the time. And then I'm going to have to waste some money repairing. Okay, yeah. Sell all fish. Damage needs to be repaired. Oh, wow. We made a lot of money. Okay. 
Oh, I found that. Greater Mara is growing. Okay. In fact, I granted a consent for the shipwright to expand. The dry dock is operational. He may have something to talk about you. Glad you've chosen to stay here with us. So, yeah, stuff's happening. Significant improvements to your vessels. Talking extra space, more attachment points, etc. Yada yada. Uh, materials we need to the dredge, basically, and we can't do any of that right now. So let's go to the ship right again. Uh, repair all for 30. And what does that give you? Plus 7 knots. Okay, we can sell that when we come to it. Now I would like to get the next engine. But for that I need to research it, I think. And I don't know, what does that do? It seems it's... Your boats. I'm not entirely sure what it does. That might not be a good idea. Oh well. Um, we are going to go back out because we need to work at night to get those squid. Missed that gold one. Okay, and let's go and see what we can, oh, hello, that's, no, what are these? Eels? Don't even want eels. No, don't want eels. See what this lot is. Black grouper. Another black grouper. I can't fit any more in, so we might as well turn around and head home. Not sure what that was. Don't want to know. Or do I want to know? Who knows? But we do need to sleep. So what we'll do is we'll dock. We'll pop to the fishmonger. Yes. So we wanted two of them. One of them. Is that another $89? Crab pot's okay. Here's one. It's a bit banged up. You can fix it at the ship, right? Okay. Drop it in the sea. Fiddler crab and a common crab. I found this book. Okay. Okay, so these are damaged. That one lasts for three days. Selling all the fish I've got. Wow, we're loaded. Uh, and what we're going to do is pop, oh hang on, E, I need you to repair me crab pot first, don't I? Uh, looks like you got some equipment, we can repair that here. Repair mode. Exit repair mode. Okay. That's, uh, I mean, I'm, I, I'll i be honest, I am finding the, the interface for this is very nice. 
me come over here. Okay, well, it looks like we're catching mackerel. And then I want to deploy that and you get a little beacon there. So we can come back to that later. Let's go over this way, shall we, a bit? What are you? Oh, okay. Uh, encyclopedia. Yes. No, not what I wanted. Okay. All oh, right. Yeah. Rod reels and rigs on the shelf. Okay. That will do some more for me I'm sure oh just the same but we'll have a fancy one now got to be said I think there is quite a bit more to this game than just this there's obviously there's a big map there's a, a lot of different fishes there's different rods all sorts of interesting stuff oops oh what are you a barb deal that I think is an aberration Yeah, because that's what it should be. Get one more, I think. Time is ticking, but I think we're just around the back of Greater Marrow at the moment. There's Blackstone Island. There's a whole, whole twisted stuff over there. There's a lot of Islands, obviously. That's more eels. That looks to be a wreck, but I can't dredge yet, so no real point to it. Those are rays. I don't think I can fit them in the hold. Uh, I'll come back to that another time. Night is falling. I'd like to get a reasonable amount of sanity. Oh, hello. What's this, though? Look inside. Oh, wow. Uh, take that and the research point. I'm going to have to return for them later. Because it's getting dark. And I'm getting panicked. Still, I'm sure we'll be fine. I'm sure there's absolutely nothing to be worried about. I wonder whether I can... Uh, Nothing in the pot yet. Yeah, that definitely looks like uh, something important. Anyway, let's um, go and see Spodley here. What is it today? Now, this is the sort of specimen he's alive and up by die. I wonder, he runs his fingers along the fish as though feeling something. He pushes from one side of his stomach and a small shape can be seen. There's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Okay. I'll pay you well if you find more. Okay. So let's sell the fish. 
Uh, and let's. Oh, I'm looking through your. But not here. Meet me on Blackstone Island. I know where it is. Uh, let's. Nothing really there. Uh, what about research? Improved outboard. Now let's go back to see the shipwright. Uh, let's sell that and install that. So I think that gives us a significant boost. I could actually sell that, but it's only going to give me an extra five knots. That only gives you seven knots, so, you know, not really worth it. Uh, and oh, what does the mayor want? Hmm. Oh, is there anything you particularly wish to know about? Blackstone Isle, don't know a great deal. Technical falls on a joint of it was sold to a private owner some 20 years ago. Very complicated. It's not meant the owner, I suspect they don't live. It's another area. Uh, don't know anything about them. So, let's sleep. We'll go to Blackstone Island, uh, and that will probably do us for this this episode well we got a crab we'll go and sell that trinket first as well Ooh, bad weather what's this I think we need to have a fish here Ooh. That's not creepy at all. One more. Time is it? Oh yeah, plenty of time. Something weird here about these skates as well. Hold on. Oh, I haven't got space for it. Damn it. Uh, that is. It's going to be awkward. But not if we do that. Okay. Let's go here. Go and see you. Sell all trinkets. There we go. Cast off. Go to Blackstone Island and see what's there. Because I think at the moment we are. Oh, oh, we've got the crab crab meter on there. I never noticed it was a crab meter. Okay. So, uh, bound in crimson ribbon. Well, well, you came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a collector. It doesn't introduce itself at all. It just tells you what he is, not who he is. You have something for me. You give me the handkerchief, you hold it up. Mm. Patterns are unmistakable, even after all this time. The handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. Carried items of great importance. You can imagine dream them is proving challenging. That's where you come in. 
I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks in dark depths. Find me these lost relics and I will reward you in ways beyond imagining. You need not give up your fishing career. I mean, you need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. Well, you know, you accept, don't you? Because without that, you ain't getting dredging. And without dredging, ring, necklace, watch, music box and a key. Okay. Dock and what's my uh, situation like? I could fit one. No, they're cod. Don't want cod. Oh, I could dredge. Now this is a different mini game, and I've got no space. Let's not dredge. <laughs> I have seen the mini game. I do know how it plays out, but um, no, nothing there. We've just got the crab so far. Well, that's dredge for you so far. Nothing too sinister, apart from mutant fishers. Packages of suspicious nature. Uh, shit, right, I should be able to patch them up. Yes, we're aware. Where's my crab? Oh, so we're just waiting for the fiddler crab on that one. And... No, I wanted to sell fish. Return to town. Ah. Okay, can you enter and take a look through the books? Your book's a book, hands it here. Correct engine operation added, okay. I'm still not really in a position to do much other than. So I've got the simple skimmer that will get the weighted line, which is considerably better actually so we'll sell that and we'll buy that bargain Ninety eight percent complete on that. That should complete shortly, and then there's correct. So this basically ten percent chance of not reduce suspicion stock when you do it. So yeah, let's just. Um, oh hello. Do you ever have any shipwrecks? She eyes you suspiciously. There's a spot near the back of Great Tomorrow. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow. Okay. Uh, uh, da da. If you hold the lantern up so it shines brightly, mm. or is it just another of Fob's tricks? Mm. I see a lot of things. Yeah, you've already. I should go because you are a fruit loop. There's a builder. Mm. What is it like out there? I don't want to talk about it. It's got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town. Going backwards. Uh, yeah, lost in thought. Say, so if you can't find me some materials, maybe you can't move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point to the north. Two units of lumber and scrap is all I need. I'm making a new place for myself. You'd be yeah. welcome to visit. Slack it up. Stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything, and I'll pay you when the job's done. Okay. Uh, and the mayor. Uh, no, I don't want to know what happened. Anyway, well. I think that will see us for this episode, but this is a very pretty game, and until next time, thank you very much for watching, I will see you soon, bye for now.